Hello everyone, Dr. Friend here. If you want to look young at least 10 years, then this video is for you. You might have seen three group of people. Group number one, people with overweight or obese, they start looking older. Second group will be people with normal weight, even then they start looking older. Third group will be the people who lose their weight and after losing weight, they start looking older. What exactly happening in your body so that you are started looking older? If you see your skin, it is made up of fat and protein. If you see the fat, it is made up of cholesterol and saturated fats. Then coming to this three group of people. First group of people, if you see the first group of people, they are overweighted. Second group of people, even they are not obese, they are started looking older. Maybe because of nutritional deficiencies or maybe because of bad habits. The third group of people, they are losing weight to look younger, but they started looking older. Why? This is because if you see any nutritional plan, they usually work upon lowering calories. That means 500 calories, 600 calories, like they're playing on calories. To reduce these calories, you will take less amount of fat, you will take less amount of carbohydrates and moderation of proteins. So you are missing healthy fats. If you miss these healthy fats, even if you lose weight, you will start looking older. So as I told you, your skin has cholesterol, saturated fats and proteins. So you should focus on healthy cholesterol, healthy fats and proteins. If you include some vitamins and minerals, which I'm going to tell you at the end of the video, this will make you look younger. Don't think that you have to take a lot of cholesterol. Your body itself is making around 3000 milligrams of cholesterol every day. Just you need to supplement with small amount. Like if you take fatty fish, if you take meat, if you take egg yolk, cod liver oil, olive oil, these are good source of healthy cholesterol. This small amount, if you include in your diet, this will help you to look younger. If you take cholesterol and fat in your diet, this will stimulate a bile secretion, a bile secretion from the liver. This bile will break this fat for absorption. When this bile breaks this fat for absorption, along with this fat, a fat soluble vitamins will be absorbed. So fat is very essential in your nutrition. If you don't take sufficient amount of fat, your bile will not be secreted in sufficient amount. So your fat soluble vitamins will not be absorbed in a sufficient amount. So you, you will have deficiency of Vitamins, especially for maintenance of your skin to look younger, you need vitamin A and vitamin E. Both of them are fat soluble vitamins. If you have low fat in your diet, then these vitamins will not be absorbed properly. So your skin will start looking dry, scaly. Vitamin A will maintain your skin, especially this epidermis and dermis in healthy form. So what are the food items which are good source of vitamin A? Green leafy vegetables are very good source of vitamin A. Goat cheese, fatty fish, cod liver oil, butter, egg yolk these are few things which are very good source of vitamin a this will make you look younger if you have sufficient vitamin a in your body your skin will not be dry it will be soft and firm also this vitamin a acts on your gene at genetic level it will increase the collagen formation this is required for your healthy skin next vitamin e you might have seen many people applying vitamin e oils over the face over the body to look young along with external you have to give it internally what are the food items which are rich in vitamin E, which makes you look younger? Palm oil, especially the red palm oil, olive oil, nuts, almonds, walnuts, nuts. Next is green leafy vegetables, kale, spinach. If you include these food items in your diet, this will prevent free radical formation. This will prevent fibrosis. You will start looking younger. So the bonus point for today's video is advanced glycated end products. What are these? These are generated when you combine protein with fat or protein with carbohydrates. I'll give you an example. If you deep fry your chicken, it has protein and it has fat. You are cooking in fat. It will create these glycated products. Next thing, once you cook a protein with sugar or carbohydrate, once you cook a protein with the fat, these products, these sticky proteins are generated. This will attach to your artery and many other organs and they will make you look older. Do smoking, this will generate free radicals in your body and uh, this will make you look older. So guys, in this video, I have given you few tips to look younger, try to follow this. If you find my videos informative, like, share and subscribe. Thank you.